If you like it or not, <laughs> we're going on Game of Thrones. It started off on Onyx Team Slayer, our game one. So, Trey, talk to me about the straight score. Dude, straight look. Okay, you tell me a little bit more, actually, because you watched the you did the online qualifier. Don't forget them. And I, I watched the rebroadcast, but I wasn't there. I didn't okay. get to, I, I wasn't sort of first-hand commentating myself. But I've heard amazing things about him. You know, I uh, when I talked with Jordan, and he said that he heard them communicate. He said that one of the greatest things about their communication was that they never get frustrated. They're never that team that's, like, complaining or, you know, uh, just getting, getting mad at each other. They don't, they don't scream at each other. They don't, they don't get right. upset. Exactly. They're, they're so calm. That was the thing that... I got the most excited about, in my opinion, uh, when we were casting them because that's what it was. It, we, we would go into a listen and we didn't know much about them. Uh, we, we'd go into a listen in and then it, you would just you would hear them and they'd just be so calm. Everything would be like, hey, top green, guys. All right, nice job. Uh, at red, I'm going to red. It was just a very calm and relaxed pace, you know, of communication. And as, as the games would go on, you know, maybe they'd be in a really stressful situation where uh, they were down, you know, X amount of kills, and there was a tough comeback, or it Somebody was... Somebody warrior done. Right, Somebody got, something, you know, right, some unfortunate... Didn't help each other. Right, something unfortunate happened, and then they were to stay calm, even that, even after that. In look every at, situation. Look at their positioning right here. They have all the map points, points on the map covered. They're being extremely aggressive. They need to be extremely aggressive on goals. They're forcing spawns that are going to be messed up. Double, easy double kill by, by a Dramus. Who is one of your uh, favorite players to watch on this squad? Well, honestly, uh, they're all a very balanced group. You see, uh, typically you'll see Dome Rock do really well. Uh, Dream is obviously a very solid player for this squad. Uh, and then Dodge Bullets, a guy who can honestly step it up. So it's really tough to say. We've seen a lot of Dreamus because we've watched his point of view from our online qualifiers. So I, I guess I'm going to have to go with uh, Dreamus as far as you know, uh, the, the player to watch, but Bullets, I gotta talk about this Bullets guy for just a moment. Bullets sits back about five feet from his screen. And he, and he sits cocked in his feet up. Like he's, like he's, like, like he's literally sitting on his couch at home. Like, like his mom's about to serve smoke and cookies. Like right. he's watching the movie. Literally. For his girl. Yes. Oh boy. Didn't want to just come there. And, <laughs> anyways, I'm calling it, dude. 50 to 26. <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> 50 to 26? <laughs> Why did oh they pick my. that name? Because it's a good name. They man. knew I was going to tear that apart, though. They had to. Well, right as I was talking about I Dodge Bullets, he's not doing too good, and he's doing a very terrible... <laughs> he's, doing a te he's doing a terrible job of dodging bullets because he only has one kill, so I'm assuming he's died quite a bit. But that is going to be another kill picked up for Dramus as his team is starting to roll here. Now, the other team 50 is... 50 to 26, 50 to 26, 50 to 26. Is Don't Blink. 50 to 26. Don't Blink being coma, fear, tyranny, tragedy, and, of course, beans. And all of these cats are locals of ours. I guess you call it local, same state. Uh, on down to K-Town. All of them? Really? Yeah. Beans. Dodge bullets and all them? Beans actually lives about five minutes from me. Ten minutes from me. What? Yeah. Wow, I don't know any of our locals. Uh, yeah. No. Oh my gosh, Dream is. <laughs> okay, I take that back. 50 or 31. Okay, well, I don't believe you, and Trey, let's get a first look at that listen-in with Strafe. How you, about it? After I say this, yes, I'm a jerk, because this is my team. I chose them. Fair enough. They're going to win every game. Oh. Every game. Oh. I got it. I got it. No, 39. Good Blue green ramp. I got your help. Go me. Go to the next one. One's at red window. One's at red window. All red window. Push red. Push red. Try to do red. Red red. Bears also on the wing. Tragedy's one shot. Tragedy's still there. Bottom Tragedy's dead. Two guys red. Two guys red green. Top green. Top green. Top green. Bottom red too. Bottom red. Front right. They're at red. They're at red. Bottom green beans. We're not pushing red yet. We're not pushing red yet. Bottom blue. Bottom blue. Bottom mid is one shot. Don't mess with me. I got red yellow. Red yellow. Bottom blue. Bottom blue. I'm not even red. Bottom red now. Top red. 
Two top red, I'm nading it. Alright, let's push red together. Push nading right. it. I'm ready. I'm pushing right, go, 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 go. Two bottom red. Beans one, bottom red gold. Another one bottom red fear. Top red dead, bottom red. Bottom, bottom red fear. Top red one shot, got two, I got red two. Three dead, three dead. Bottom, bottom red one shot. Last guy. I got him. Nice. Nice. Good job, guys. Stake these kids. It's spawning blue. Spawning blue. Spawning blue. Bottom blue. Bottom blue. They're on blue green bubble. I got one shot. One shot. They're on blue gold. Coma's one shot. Coma's down. Coma's down. Another one bottom blue. Tragedy. One beans is weak on gold. I'm pushing your hole. 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 I'm 50 to 29. So they'll meet you right Steak in the middle. And, dinner, that is a and they steak. stand up. Dinner they stand they're so up. They're excited. Like, we don't have to eat McDonald's tonight. No. We are eating steak, ladies and gentlemen. We're, we're that is going to be a steak floppy this with 18 steak, kills for steak, his team. Steak burger off the McDonald's dollar menu. Delicious. I wonder what they'll have as a side item. They might have. They might be the having Mc, more steak. Mixed steak? The mixed steak. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> well, that is a positive 11 for floppy. 13 and 7 for Dramus with 10 assists. So this team coming out firing on all cylinders. Not the best game from Don't Bleak, but look at look at Dodge Bullets too. 12 assists. This is locking it down. You know, he died the most, yes, on his team. But look how each one of them was in a single. He was just deaths. very casually running around the map and just delivering shots and and just trying to stay alive. Dr Dramus with an all around can. good gameplay though. Oh yeah. You know, good assists, good kills, low deaths, playing really well. Indeed. Uh, so I, I kind of feel like you get that from each uh, team member, or you'll get at least one guy on the team who doesn't do so hot, but has really high assists. And that's typically just because you have a guy on the map that's going to be running It's always going to be like that. Right. It's all, I mean, every right. team is like that. Not everyone's going to be able to have the glory. Um, but this team, but very we well-rounded. see it from very, their next game. So. Very well-rounded team. And I'm, I'm, I cannot tell you how excited I am to start seeing teams that haven't done anything at a tournament yet to start putting together a roster, sticking with it, yep. and continuing to practice for the event. I, oh it's exciting. We, we've it, seen it, it a little bit already with Almost Heaven. I know. Uh, so it's it, it's really fun to see, and it's just going to get better and better as we go, guys. So we're going to throw it off to a quick commercial break, but when we come back, we'll have game two for you in this round two matchup. You guys stay tuned. Yeah. And we're back, kicking it off with game number two. We got Station Nine Extraction, my favorite game type. Our Your favorite, favorite game, type. game type. Hey, I was bringing you in. Okay. Just after really? me. That's fair. I'm, <laughs> I'm typically after you. So. And look at him trying to go for quick extract, but they're able to trade kills off the start. Oh, and four you dead hear them for that blink squad. Scream it from the top of the mountain. You know, they're just kind of dancing on the rockets, but they'll go ahead and pick and, those and up. Look, they got the time. This team is smart, though. Look, they got it on green side, and guess what that sets them up for? The next extraction. The next extraction. That's exactly what I'm talking about. True, but did they pay attention to maybe where those spawns might go? Oh, they, they might not they have, have rockets, fast so enough, obviously. But they they do have those rockets. Boom. Hey, I'll spot that guy through Big the wall. tragedy. No big deal. What a tragedy. That sucks. Later. So that look is at them be, all. Again, three dead for this don't blink squad, and this is not looking good to start off the game. Look at them all. They're all top middle. This is perfect. This is exactly what I've always wanted a team to do. Be extremely aggressive. They are going to lose we these don't rockets. Have anyone at blue? And that is they got cause. unlucky. That with is that. they're going to watch those rockets. Just easy nade on that guy. Domi going through those rockets, trying to win the second battle. So they are Almost going to kill. get that extraction, that initial extraction, doing such a good job of setting up at green. But that small mistake of not getting that blue area locked down is going to cause the other team to spawn. That is going to be an easy extraction. But nonetheless, they have responded very well. So we have Dreamus moving in. He catches an aid and he's going to dive. That is two down for Don't Blink, an enemy player. And that is Zach going to get taken out at top blue. So unfortunately, they're not going to get the flank. However, they do have the angles game. It's going to be difficult to get this extract, but they do have a spawner. Oh, oh my gosh, Dreamus catching this it's beautiful spawn on the anchor. 
But look, they've already they have gotten the oh. counter extract again. So yep, and he knows to give it up right there. Enough. He yep. knows. He knows. Hey, we got to get Good the call. next extract. That's, Good call. that's smart. These players, I'm telling you, they're impressing me with every turn. The reason why they're good is not just because they have good shots or just good teamwork because they've played together a long time. Each of them are making good decisions. They're very fundamentally sound. Yes. They really are. And even though they had a minor mistake at oh. the beginning of the game to cause them the second extraction, they have done well. They've, rebound, they've rebounded really fast. Rebounded? And rebounded. We're going to call that. We're going to say rebounded. We're say rebounded. And, uh, and look what's happening here is one play oh, that oh, I really no. like. No. Oh, oh pulls out the right rifle. Right. Right. He, he goes goes for it. <laughs> but uh, look what they did though to set up this third extraction tray. What they did is they actually pushed bullets and Dreamus actually pushed top middle and engaged at top middle opposed to just staying in top yellow and letting them come to them. So, uh oh, but they have, they had, oh, 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 oh my gosh, I didn't think he was going to make that jump there for a second. But they did have, you're going to need that light rifle. Light rifle. Oh, there it oh, is. Oh, I thought he had him. But they did get that the extra. That might be a big kill. Coma versus Zach. And, that's going to be dodge bullets winning the battle there. Hopping on board with him as he picks up that light rifle. That is going to eat, be an easy extraction for Strafe as they're moving towards top blue. Bullets making a good play here, getting a couple of shots on Fear and picking up that Gosh, kill. Really nice Big play, three him. players alive now for top green for Strafe. This should be an easy, quick initial three second extraction, but nobody watched top middle. So unfortunately, he's going to take some shots and be one shot, but he should be able to stay alive here in this situation. Yet again, another great transition by Strafe. Extremely smart that he has a light rifle. one. I mean, would you say this is probably one of the most light rifle prominent maps that you could play on? Uh, I agree, uh, definitely. And I think the reason why is just because of how the map is built. It's huge. There's so many hallways. Yeah. It's just like narrow hallway after narrow hallway. Oh my god. He's gonna run up and get this if he gets this kill. Coma's gonna take that, it out. That's that an been. interesting play right there. You know, he didn't just go for the shots. He decided to do as much damage as he possibly could, and he almost made it a 50-50 chance if he hadn't had somebody else clean him up. Yeah, it was really good reaction. That was, that, that was really smart. And we see them dropping the ordinances, and see, this is going to be the advantage that's going to give them the ability to win against some of the top teams. And they were actually able to pick up the extracting player there. He does have a shield, so Dodge Bullets is going to dropping go ahead. The shield. Drop that shield, stay alive. Just in time, he's going to cut the corner. So oh great God. hard light shield play <laughs> there by Dodge Bullets as he has kept oh, these players in top this. middle. But look at this. Nobody watching the bottom red as it looks like Don't Blink is going to be trying to push this initial extraction. Getting into a fight with Tragedy is Bullets, and he's going to win that fight, staying alive one shot. Very good play oh, as he catches another player, field. bottom yellow. A little bit Three too to late. one here, but look, we have Don't Blink getting a couple of kills here. Three dead for Strafe. Right now, Dreamus being the only player top middle. This would be a very easy extraction for Don't Blink. And they hold it down. You know, you gotta give it to Strafe because their coordination is on point. If they make one good push, they have a lot of slave power, so they're gonna be able to get this Link squad sort of ruffling their right. feathers. Right, and, and what I would ruffle. expect, what I would expect for this team to do is get one strong push here, and if they don't get it, which it looks like they might not be able to, two players down for Strafe, they might just elect to go for the next extraction, which I think would be the good play here. That is going to be Dome Rocked now on your screen. Looking top middle with just under eight seconds to go on this extraction point. They know it's coming top middle, and guess what they're setting it up for? That green side. It looks like their communication was good there, and Dome Rocked. Oh, no, excuse me. Bullets side. is actually going to be the one to grab it, and that is indeed yellow side. There's no, that is green side. Oh, no, you're right. I'm so sorry. Gosh, oh, I knew one of us was retarded, and it was me. Well, one of us was going to be right, <laughs> so I just, you know, I went with it. <laughs> Looking for that double kill as he is going to pick it up. Nice play by Dome Rocked. They're staying alive, winning their individual battles. Perfect formula for winning a game type, just like Station 9 Extraction. So see as they're able to come up. But man, Strafe is playing out of their mind, but I would really like to see what is going on over on this Don't Blink squad. I'd like to hop on board with Tyranny as he, in my opinion, is one of the most underrated players. Oh, my gosh. As far as four amateur shot players. Half shield. That's embarrassing. So on board right now, we are with Fear Tyranny from Don't Blink. As I said, I feel like he is one of the more one of the more underrated amateur players right now, currently in the game. As you'll watch, he's just a very smart player, and most importantly, he has a fantastic shot. So let's see if he and Don't Blink are able to maybe come back and uh, make and make this a game for him, because they they only need one more extraction, that being Strafe, of course, to win the game. So they're going to have to play very very smart here. And. In my opinion, I feel like a perfect game on Station 9. Uh, five, winning 5 to 0 is not a perfect game. That's a lucky game. Okay. That's luck. 
winning look at a that perfect, play. a perfect game to me is five to two. That is a perfect game. To me. Oh, okay. Because you give, yeah, because you have to give up some extractions, and honestly, giving those extractions sets you up for the new one. It, it makes it a quicker game. You know, that is fantastic logic, actually, as he's just going to come across some rockets, like, uh, every day. I yeah, just, well, I just, you know, I just love present? rockets. They grow out of the ground for me. Ooh, a piece of candy. Doop de doop. I love gardening. Let me just I love dig. rockets. Boomy boom boom. <laughs> boom boom. In my belly. Boom boom, boom bang. Boom. Bing bong bow. So tyranny, of course, getting this blanket yellow. Very good play as this. Oh, that's going to be a sketchy rocket, oh, but I love it. For it. That is such a good play by Tyranny. Bow. Fantastic. Bow. That is going to be a double kill for Tyranny. Triple. Staying alive here is what he's going to need to do. Maybe anchor some spawns for his fourth teammate that has a spawn. But look at this. He's going to go ahead and jump on that quick extraction. Oh, Three seconds. He he's going to get it before that he dies. Perfect. Two right before down it. for Strafe. They do have a member across the map as well as two players top middle. That is this very, is gonna be very a hard one. This is going to be a hard one to convert for Strafe. Yes. Well, they now have three players top middle, and that seemed to be the anchor spawn. Everyone, the remaining two players for Don't Blink spawning top middle. Now, they're going to have to make a strong push into this area. They're going to have at least two players there to challenge them, and Tyranny actually elects to go down and grab this jetpack that is not going to be there for him. So, very, very Interesting unfortunate. Interesting play by is, Tyranny. I think they've taken too long here. It, you know, Don't Blink really has to make a play right now. Well, they do have the extraction, so they surprisingly, Strafe has not pushed them. So I guess they are going to get this, but hey, like you said, you know, you win some, you lose some, and Stra that's, Stra the, that's Stra the way to win. Team, if, if they're going to give this up, it's because they chose to. Four to four now. Just like we said, Don't Blink is going to need to come back here. But Tyranny making an amazing play, and he's oh going to get the quick my gosh. He's going to die here, though, for sure, so he's got to make sure that he has a player okay. He might be able to have a teammate run up there. I don't know if I agree with that. I mean, it was it was a it was a good play. It really was. But if he had stayed alive, if he had gotten that just, back smack and ran away, right, or gotten a couple oh shots at top middle and stayed alive, and kind of you're anchoring the map and pinching the enemy. So I think that's definitely what you'd want to do. But unfortunately, uh, he he made a quick decision, like we say. And you see uh, it wasn't how necessarily well a bad one, but it could have worked out better. So and rocket should be coming up pretty soon, actually. So now this is going to be a big, big push for Don't Blink. They're going to have to do this right. They cannot afford to die here, but this will go to Strafe. So Tyranny getting in a fight with Dramus as he does have a teammate. He's going to need that arc light to stay alive. He's challenging here. They're going to have to be very, very careful. They this have is going to be go it. For it here. They have Tyranny to go has the hard light. His teammate is going to have to go for it, and that is what they are setting up for right now. He's got too many enemy players shooting at him, and that is just not going to do it. That is going to go to Strafe. Strafe being extremely smart, though, in that last play. You saw how you couldn't find any of them at the very end. It wasn't just one of those moments where everybody's fighting and they're screaming, oh, they're on it, they're on it, we have to kill him early, kill him now, quick, kill him quick. Right. No, they were hiding. They waited until they knew that he was extracting them. It was that. a very, very good play by Strafe. Now, I, I, it was a pretty solid coordinated push by by Don't Blink. It really was. It you was know, fear, they had Tyranny all three. had the hard light. Mm -hmm. uh, his teammate behind him knew, they already knew that he was going to have to grab it. And he had a pretty good hard light. He blocked a couple of shots there, but unfortunately there was just too many players well, shooting had, at him. He had a guy on each angle, so right. there's no way he could have hard lighted both guys. Right, so unfortunate. I'm uh, not really sure. Maybe the other two players died uh, from his team, so they couldn't help. But that was one of those things where, in my opinion, you, you really don't want the game to come down to uh, you know, hopefully my hard light works and we make this good push. Like you said, in a perfect world, you really want to have like a 5-2, to 5-1 to one type of score. So I definitely agree with you there. But it was good plays by both teams. Uh, don't blink, definitely starting to come back. But Strafe showing us that they got, you know, they, they got some talent here on Aww. land. So it'll be a lot of fun to see them pinned up against these teams that they beat That's in the online team. qualifier. No, but... <clears throat> You know, huge shout out to the other team too, because they're all our locals, and oh, yeah. you know we've we've known them for a while now, about two years, something like that. Yeah. So there's players that have definitely continued to get better, and a big shout out to them. And again, Tyranny, they'll, they'll bounce back. They're very level-headed guys, so they'll they'll be just fine. Uh, but guys, I just want to throw. A, they'll be okay. <laughs> they'll be just, yeah, all right, uh, uh, whatever. I want to give a quick shout out to our sponsors before we throw it to a commercial, guys. That of course is going to be 812 Hertz Gaming Gum. Love it. Boom. Love it. Focus. Games Cases, which is powered our entire Halo 4 event All here the Halo in 4 IG stuff. Atlanta. High Res Studios, who is in the house with Smite this weekend. And we have Ben Q, Alienware, and of course Game Skinny. And EPB Fiber Optics Internet, guys. And of course, a big shout out to MLG. Big, huge shout out to MLG. We actually have our COD stream running on MLG TV. 
So just big things coming forward, guys. We're very excited. Hopefully some Halo stuff will be on the market in the future. Maybe even next event, maybe? Maybe, maybe. hopefully. Please. Please. So guys, stay tuned. We're going to throw it to a quick commercial break, and we'll bring you guys the next round, too.